Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I'm using the RPCS3 macOS port and today I'm going to show you how to unlock the debug tab on the system configuration settings. If I click on the config button here, then we don't have the debug tab in the settings menu. So I'm going to show you how to open that. So at this stage, we should make sure to go ahead and quit RPCS3 so that we can change the configuration file. So the next thing we're going to do is to click on the finder button here. Then we're going to press the go button. And now we're going to hold down the option key. And that's going to reveal this library shortcut here, which I'm going to click now. Then we're going to find the application support folder and then double click. And then we're going to scroll down and then find the RPCS3 folder and then double click. Then we're going to go to GUI configs and then double click. And then we're going to find the current settings.ini. We're going to hold down the control key and then click on the file then click open with and then go to text edit. So once we've opened up text edit, we're going to scroll down and then we're going to find the show debug tab equals false section here. I'm going to erase this and then type in the word true instead. And once that's edited, I'm going to press file and then save. So once that file is saved, we're going to close the finder window and then we're going to go to open up RPCS3 again. So now if I go to the configuration menu here, so now I have a debug menu item and I can go ahead and configure some of the hidden settings of RPCS3. So now anyway, I hope you found this video useful. I've got lots of other RPCS3 and emulator videos on my channel. Please check it out. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.